A total of 214 soldiers from the Singapore Armed Forces SAF took part in a multilateral exercise involving assets and soldiers from seven participating countries, the Ministry of Defense MINDEF said on Wednesday. Exercise Super Garuda Shield 2023 was held in Asambagus, Indonesia, from August 27 to September 13. It was co-hosted by the Indonesian National Defense Forces TNI and the United States Indo-Pacific Command in Dapakam. The other countries involved in this year's exercise were Australia, France, Japan and Britain. This is the second year the SAF has taken part in the exercise. SAF Director of Joint Operations Brigadier General Go Pei Ming said. Exercise Super Garuda Shield 2023 is a valuable opportunity to train alongside the TNI. In Dapakam, and participating militaries in a large scale multilateral, multi service exercise. The joint exercises and exchanges enhance mutual understanding and cooperation and strengthen the friendship amongst the participating armed forces. Both the Singapore Army and the Republic of Singapore Navy took part in the exercise with troops and assets. The Army participated in a staff planning exercise that culminated in a combined arms live firing exercise with the Australian Army, in Dapakam and TNI said MINDEF. The Navy's Endurance Class Landing Ship Tank RSS Endeavour and a Victory Class Missile Corvette RSS Vigor took part in a series of maneuver, air defense, and gunnery firing exercises in the waters off Surabaya, together with six ships from the Indonesian Navy and the US Navy.